What's up YouTube? Welcome back to Fallout 4. We on walk through part two of this game and if any of you forgot our uh, our quest basically it's out of time but we are out of the vault. Now we have to go home, so that's our objective. But before we before we start anything, let's go around this area because I know there's some stuff you could pick up, whatnot. Mm, very useful. <laughs> Just very useful. You can't interact with these bodies, sadly. You can interact with some of those. Pick up these, whatnot. Radax or Radex, really helpful. And you get two stim packs. So in total, right now I have, I think, I have six in total, basically. And what you do here is you just, you get anything you can find, basically. You are in a you're a scavenger basically so go through every box right x really helpful it boosts your um, health up a lot so you'll, you'll find a lot of those and i'm surprised because i'm on hard mode or well, very hard i'm surprised i'm finding so much stuff and there's your first uh token so be be appreciative and then you get ammo box in here and if you don't know it's just down the down the hill backwards from where you start off and you just go in this little bitty like van or mobile home whatever you want to call it and you can get you can get that and then as you can see wait let me go to my inventory as you can see I have one cap which in this game is used as money but we're gonna continue the quest see what's happening see what we can find and that's lit guys I hope you I hope you enjoyed the first one and I really hope you're going to enjoy this one because it's so much better than the prologue. I mean, prologue is still really good, but I've played it so many times. It's it's pretty repetitive now. But we're just going to continue, go on to our quest. We basically, all we have to do is go home. And there's a radar marker right there telling us how far away we are from the location. And you can go in these houses. And as you can see on the on the wall, there's a roach. So just, just be careful, cause these motherfuckers are annoying, especially when they just come out of nowhere and scare you. It's 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 just ridiculous. And you come in this house, stim pack, rat axe, and then you can unlock this, which I'm actually gonna try to do. And basically, it gives you like what? Okay, I. In this game, it's a lot harder to lockpick because you can instantly break it. And I did this before, and I got a, another lockpick from there, but sadly I broke it, so I'm just going to have to come back and get it. But you just loot the houses, which I'm not going to do that right now. I'm going to try to make this as short as possible. I'm just going to do the story, basically. I'm going to search this mailbox just to see what's in it. Okay, nothing's in it. We're just going to search every mailbox till we get to the point and... Right there, as you can see, that's Codsworth. You can shoot at him. All he'll do is, like, say, Stop shooting me! What not. But we're going to talk to him, see what's happening. As I live and breathe, oh, it's, it's really you. My God, they did it. Those bastards really did it. Everything's dead. Everything's dead? Ah, yes, the gum. Uh, the posies have been uh, problematic, I admit. Ah, if only the missus were here to help. Where is she, by the by? They... They killed her. Sir, these things you're saying, these, these terrible things, uh, I believe you need a distraction. Yes, a distraction to calm this dire mood. It's been ages since we've had a proper family activity. Checkers, or perhaps charades. Sean does so love that game. <laughs> Is the lad uh, with you? He's gone. God damn it. Someone took him. Someone stole my son. It's worse than I thought. Hmm? You're suffering from hunger-induced paranoia. Not eating properly for 200 years will do that, I'm afraid. 
Two hundred years? What? Are you? A, a bit over two hundred and ten, actually, sir. Or oh, give and take a little for the Earth's rotation and some minor dings to the old chronometer. <laughs> that means you're uh, two centuries late for dinner. <laughs> Perhaps I can whip you up a snack. <laughs> you must be famished. What? Food? Y yeah, sure. I I need a minute to think. Then I'll be right back. Okay, basically you just follow him. I mean, <clears throat> I can't really hear the TV, so I don't know if he's telling me to get food for him because he is a robot, but I'm not going to judge him for that, but he's probably telling me to get some food for myself. Mr. Handy Fuel got oh oh okay and now I remember I know I remember what's happening now. Empty milk bottle. You just you just loot the area basically. Nobody needs it. Everyone's dead. Sad to say, but everyone's dead and they don't need this stuff. So you just take whatever you find. Whoa. The Red Menace? Why, the Communists, of course! The Russians and the Chinese! Codsworth, buddy. I don't think the Reds are going to be a problem anymore. I have an idea. Let's search the neighborhood together. After all, the Mrs. and Young Sean, they're... They're my family, too. All right. Lead the way. Out to serve, sir. Okay, we just completed it. I thought I messed up my. Uh, this is Sean's crib, so my baby's gone, whatnot. But basically, oh, I can take all the toys, all I want. I love toys; they're so cool. But I can take everything in the house. Wife's dead, baby's gone. They don't need it. And anyway, when I find my son, if I do, which I'm not gonna spoil anything. Uh, a perfect coffee tin. It just, I, I'm telling you, everything in this game, loot it, take it, it's yours, and then sell it when you get to a certain point of the game. I promise, is that a baby bottle? It's a baby bottle. I promise you, look at these old school milk cartons, bro. Like, this is life. Like, this is old school, like, this is like futuristic old school. Best thing you can ever do. Yes. By the way, this is a collectible, so once you do get in here, there's a bunch of them. I wouldn't rec- I mean, you can sell them, but they're collectibles, basically, and then you get a trophy if you can find all of them, which, unless if you're a trophy hunter, I doubt you're going to find it, but come over here, take anything and everything. They don't need it. And you will find it very, very useful. But you saw that was a crafting table. You don't need anything, basically. Not yet, anyways. Just have your pistol. <clears throat> you should be Gucci for a while. I'm going to follow Codsworth. He's waiting for me. And I'm not going to keep him waiting. So, Ash got it. Ash got it. Where's the door, buddy? Well, there it is. <laughs> I'm dumb. Sean's out there, Codsworth. I need to find him. What about Concord, sir? Plenty of people there. And last I checked, they only pummeled me with sticks a few times before I had to run back home. There's still people alive in Concord? Yes, although they're a bit rough. Do you remember the way? Just across the southern footbridge out of the neighborhood and past the Red Rocket Station? 
Okay, we got information on where to go next. We're probably gonna head up there with Codsworth and see what's going on. For right now, I'm just gonna try to Buffalo Glen, Boat Fly Glen, those things. <laughs> I promise you, especially on a difficult difficulty, they are a pain. But you're just gonna search every house. I mean, I'm, I'm making a video right now, guys, but all of you can actually play the game and see what you can get and see what you can't get. Actually, oh, stim pack. Like, I'm telling you, early on in the game, you can find stim packs everywhere. The pumpkin, plastic pumpkin, uh, toy car. I don't even know what that said, but <clears throat> you can take everything. Codsworth is on his own now. You can interact with them, but our new objective now I'm not gonna search the houses I'll probably do that in my free time but if we go to the map <coughs> actually let's see what the quest is out of time investigate Concord so basically Concord is a sanctuary you'll find out more about that later and then Concord is all the way over here how do we place a marker uh, 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 that's not what I want <laughs> As I wait, how oh, fuck? Okay, there we go. I'm dumb. All right, there we go. <clears throat> Place the marker. You know what? Let's take that marker off. It's no help. I can see. I can see what's on the map, and I know my location. I've been playing Fallout ever since the first one. Come on now. But I remember in Fallout Three, like how this alligator thing came out of the water, and I was. Maybe it was Skyrim. I think it was Oblivion and there was a big ass fish in the water. And then it attacked me and I was getting scared. I couldn't attack in the water or whatnot. Raw mongrel. Basically, it's basically a coyote. So, you know what? Just for XP, I'm going to go ahead and kill it. Just for XP. I'm going to probably stealth kill it. I tried to. Okay, that was a lot of bullets, but that's some XP. I wasted some energy. And there's something over here. I don't know if it's a threat, though. Is it a threat? Okay, there's no threat, so I'm not going to kill it. You know what? I'm highly against killing animals in general, but this is a game, and I'm not going to be so worried about it. Later on in the story, you'll come back here to investigate it. So we're not going to be going for there. We're just going to continue on, see what we can find, whatnot. Oh, don't tell me. Oh. Oh, this is some big ass mosquitoes. Oh. Ooh. Ah, bitch. Get out of my way. Oh my god. <laughs> Uh, what? I, I, I'm telling you guys. Okay, what's up, guys? We just found the dog. Our dog. This is the area. I made a mistake. You do come back to this area at one point. But you do greet the dog, which I'm going to do. Hey, boy. What are you doing out here all by yourself? <laughs> you seem like an okay guy. Okay then, let's stick together. And basically, you can command him, whatnot. He's basically your, basically your little slave. He found something. Oh, nice! Like he could show you what you can get. And before I died, or after I died, I did a little bit of exploring and whatnot, and I found a lot of stuff. And I could just pipe pistol I could just basically craft or upgrade my weapon and whatnot and it takes a little bit to uh, do all this stuff stem pack right there adjustable wrench ashtray you, you just can get so much stuff once you get to the prologue you can get so much stuff in the beginning and throughout the game it's 
It's ridiculous, dude. And then you can go in the cash register. There's nothing in here but pre-war money, which basically you can't do anything with besides get caps for it. And you turn on the radio or whatnot. Military grade duct tape. Like, I've never seen that in my life before, so I want to see. I guess it's. Ooh, 21 bottle caps. Like, you see that, right? Okay, what is hitting me? Oh, shit. What the fuck? Okay. I need to heal right now. I almost died right there because the, the dog was being a little bit late, you feel me? I almost died. <laughs> uh, thank you for the cigarettes. I can sell these later on. But, like, you can die so quick. So, if any of you decide to play this, any of you hard-ass motherfuckers like me, play on very hard or survival. You'll get about the same amount of stuff. It's just a lot harder, whatnot, etc. And then, uh, yeah, basically, and, uh, the rad X, basically, if you have rad poisoning, because it, it counts. Okay. Oh, shit. Where is it? I need to help my dog. Get out of my dog! Die! <laughs> Good lord, mole rats! Calm down! And if you hear anything barking, that's my dog again. So don't front or anything. That's just my dog. Sorry for the quality or whatnot. But I can't prevent my dog, and I'm not gonna tell it to shut up because that's not nice. And yeah, basically, I have the dog. It helps me. I don't think the dog can die, honestly. But it, you just continue the journey. Well, not, but I picked up a lot of stuff. And do I want to challenge those bugs again? You know what? Let's do it. I'm not hitting the bug. Okay, basically, you fucked. <laughs> Unless if you can. Where'd you go? It's gonna sneak up on my ass. I guarantee you. He's over here somewhere. I think he's hurt. What not? You know what? If it comes up on me, it comes up on me. I'm not even gonna challenge it. I see a box up there, so I'm gonna go ahead and get it. <clears throat> Let's see if it's the bug or the box. But I think it's a box. Yes, it is a box. Psycho duct tape wrench. Okay, nice. You can't use any of these weapons, by the way. So, just best bet is to sell them. There's no need to keep them. And this if it's like duct tape or whatnot. Those are crafting materials. Oh, okay. There's my dog. The dog will eventually... Okay, these things are, this thing is destroyed. The dogs will eventually uh, come to you. Like this. Like You can pick up herbs and whatnot. And create hillables throughout the game but we're not gonna collect all that much stuff I mean what whenever chance we get we're gonna collect as many things as possible okay we're in Concord pick up herbs everything that's probably the most beneficial thing in this game okay I don't know why okay I guess it's not skilled enough okay it just exploded <laughs> I guess it's not skilled enough, but conserve your ammo. Your ammo is like, besides the health and whatnot, it's your most like useful thing. But we're gonna search this house, not any other house. But we're gonna search this house because I'm pretty sure, if I'm not mistaken, there's some stuff in here. Ah, it's one of these. Good lord, everything's blocked off. I don't know why. I mean, who blocked this off? I mean, the nuke was coming, whatnot. I know you can go in here. Wait, uh, I didn't mean to. I didn't mean to reload. That's not good. 
you come in here there are bandits oh this this who nuka oh those are like really good they look pretty i got 19 caps let's look let's look at my total caps because I, I know i have a lot i know i have okay i have 45 caps that's a oh Oh, brutal. Sneak up on, sneak up on us, boy. I think that was the last one that I shot earlier, but it like hit for a little bit. But we're going to continue our journey, see what's happening. I'm not going to waste all my stamina. I'm going to be walking a lot. Or in this case. Okay, those are pretty much normal I mean they probably have a little bit of radiation ooh let's see if we can ride this doubt it obviously it wouldn't be working whatnot that's fine and dandy let's check our uh, let's check our map see what's going on the Concord nothing pretty much the the red rocket truck stop really good really good sanctuary is really good and then Concord and what is it? Okay, that's Concord. So basically a castle, but it's not a castle. It's just a a big but small town and it's really fun to just do. Okay, that was the only bandit, so thank God. Ooh, look at that body. Ooh, look at that body. Ooh, look at that body. This is danger. Why is it saying danger when I crouch on it? <laughs> it's probably uh, off limits called a rape in this game. Oh, I'll get some caps, boy. Ash got it. But we're going to go around because I think there's a lot of bandits. So we'll try to like, stay out of contact as much as we can. See, see what's going on. Like. You shoot my dog, motherfucker. Blah! Ah, oh, his face just pops off. Oh my gosh! What the fuck? Oh, holy shit! We're just gonna take everything, bro. Everything. We're just gonna take everything. This is some good loot. We're gonna take that laser rifle. We're gonna take the bullets it gives us. We're just gonna feel. Damn, his body's light. We're just gonna take everything before we go in here. I'm pretty sure there's a lot of other bandits, so we'll just our raiders, as they're called in this game. I'm so used to Borderlands 2, it's ridiculous. But we're just gonna search around, see what's happening. I'm not gonna spoil anything, but there's some there's a big motherfucker that, that's gonna come up. Just saying. But it's crazy. This. I love this area. This area is probably one of my favorite areas. It's just so. It's just so. What's the word for it? It's just. It's nice. I can't think of the word, but it's nice. <clears throat> but we're gonna go in there. They're at the top of there. They're. They're not gonna shoot at me, whatnot. But I mean, I'm doing pretty good with just a pistol. I mean, I haven't lost all that much health. Actually, I haven't lost any health from gunfire. But I guarantee you, gunfire is like super deadly in this game especially if you play on survival or very hard <coughs> okay we're in here guys um in this game i mean i haven't took any damage it's real critical oh there's another raider Pop your head out, motherfucker. Oh, what's shooting me? What's shooting me? What the fuck? Take that bitch. Ooh, nice in the heart. That is in the heart. That is directly in the heart. But there's some there's some raiders in here too, but I'ma level up. I'm gonna heal myself health is real critical in this game and especially gunfire as you see my health just dropped like I 
I'm not hitting this dude. Lock's really strong. Pick out, bitch. Pick out. I'm already pre-aiming, bro. Alright, that's alright. But you, you see, my health is just dropped. I got four bobby pins. And it's it's ridiculous, but I mean, you see, you see how much health I'm using. I mean, it makes sense to put it in this game. <clears throat> All right. And the Radex, I don't think I said this before, but the Radex helps you get rid of radiation, and that's really. Okay. I don't have any grenades, not yet, so I'm just gonna run to the top. <clears throat> Let's see what's happening. Hopefully, my dog protects me. Oh, that scared me. Let's reload my gun. Look at these bodies. Look at them titties, boy. Them titties, boy. Oh, shit. Fucking the British. Move, doggy. I gotta check everything. <laughs> it's real critical to get everything you can in this. I don't know how many stim packs I have left, but I know I have a pretty good bit. But I have so much more. You know what? Let's just check it, just for, just for my sake. You feel me? I have 67 um money, uh, aid. It's called aid. Uh, I always forget. <clears throat> aid. Uh, see okay I have six stim packs who have sugar bombs I don't think that's an actual bomb but I have red axe see this is why I say uh, preserve as much as you can win every single gun fight if you can I mean you can always play on uh, easy or not very easy Recruit. I don't even know all the stuff, but you can play on that. It should be good. But try to try to win every single gunfight so I don't have to use anything. And this is a very difficult terminal. I might make a cut here later. You know, I'm not even gonna spoil anything. I'm just gonna let's just go in this box. Duct tape, scissors. Uh, not very useful. But we're gonna go up, up, up until. What is he looking? I don't think I can. Okay, it's advanced, too difficult, obviously. I'm, I'm stupid. I can't unlock any locks. <laughs> Cause I'm stupid. But we're gonna continue to go up, loot as much as possible. Ooh, there's a knife. Switchblade. So there's so many cool weapons in this game, and the sad thing is you can't use most of them. <laughs> it's dumb. But when you get to this area, just loot every room, see what you can get. It's lit. Oh, come on, doggy. Oh, shit. Take that boy! Oh, I just combination. Oh shit! Try to win every single gunfight. I know it might be hard, but you see, I hit him with my gun and just attack him like full fledged. Just it get it gets pretty brutal. But I don't know where my dog's at. I'm gonna search this area first before he shoots at me. And then I'm gonna make my way around. I know the destination tells me to go there, but if there's a chance to getting any sort of stim pack, I'm gonna take it. Any chance whatsoever, I'm gonna take it. Okay. 
Okay, now I'm gonna go over here just to see. And I think before anything happens, you have to clear out the area, all that bull crap, and see what's happening. Hopefully, my dog's not dead because that'd be really sad. <laughs> Cause he's like one of your main helps in this game. Just take everything. Just take everything. Okay, I was about to shoot at those and waste some ammunition, which is never good. <clears throat> Just loot everything. Like I, I don't know how to, I don't know how many times I say that. Like this isn't dying. Like you can't duplicate in this game anymore. Yes, you can use mods, but mods are very limited also. So. You're very limited even if you can use mods and I feel like they did it right in this game just for the fact that it's limited you can do the uh, cheat room but even then it's still limited you can't choose what you want to have amount of it's just random most of the time but this game is very very good I would recommend it to every single one of you if you like games where you can get loot or not you know what? I'm just gonna make my way upstairs so I don't have to deal with all this bull crap. How do I get upstairs? <laughs> oh, okay, I see. Oh my gosh! What the? Whoa! What was that? Oh, the motherfucker shooting at me. Alright. Alright, you can fuck off. Come on now. Alright. I'm glad you can't, like. You can't shoot through walls, because if you could, this game would be ridiculous. So we're just going to make our way upstairs, hopefully, and first I got to find it, okay? So I'll be back with you guys once I find it. Shit. Okay guys, we're back. I just had to go through this little bitty door, oh, I know which I opened here. in the oh, first place. You just walk around, go through the middle, and then come through this door, which is originally closed, as I got interrupted by a fucking grenade. But you just go upstairs, whatnot. Take out, take out, take out, my bad. <laughs> take out all the people that you can, etc. You can pick up skulls, dude, like... No! Okay guys, welcome back. You just saw me destroy his life. And right now, <laughs> I'm about to die. I guess you can call that strategy what I just did. Use my dog sort of as bait to kill the enemies, but really? Just getting warmed up over here. Really? I was just saving my ass. <laughs> okay. Now, basically what I do, I try to find some, some stim packs. Because I'm out of stim packs, as you can see. I don't have any of them in my inventory. I picked some, picked up some cool stuff. I did die and whatnot. Super sad, but, I mean, what do you expect? I am playing on very hard. It's going to be a challenge. Yeah, it really is. I mean, my character looks drunk right now. That's how badly hurt I am. It's bad, but the the war right now is over, so I'm all Gucci. <clears throat> all I need now is not to get attacked, find some fucking health, and I'll be Gucci. Basically, I'm in there. Shotgun saved me through it all. I mean, if he would have got a lucky shot on me, or not even lucky, if he would have got a shot on me, 
I would have I died, no doubt about it, but I hit him with the combinations and it's a lit bite. <laughs> it's a lit bite. Hit him with the combos, killed his ass. See what happens. Man, I don't know who you are, but your time is impeccable. Preston Garvey, Commonwealth Minuteman. Uh, Glad to help. Well, if that's true, we could use some more goodwill. As you can see, we're in a bit of a mess here. God damn it. Please, go on. A month ago, there were 20 of us. Yesterday, there were eight. Now we're five. First it was the ghouls in Lexington, and now this mess. Sorry. Sounds rough. Thanks. Maybe. It's good to meet someone who nope. really cares. Anyway, we figured Concord would be a safe place to settle. Those raiders proved us wrong. But, uh, well, we do have one idea. One good idea can make all the difference. Sturgis, tell him. There's a crashed vertebrate up on the roof. Old school, pre-war. You might have seen it. Well, looks like one of its passengers left behind a seriously sweet goodie. We're talking a full suit of Cherry T-45 power armor. Military issue. What makes that power armor so special? A West Tech internalized servo system, that's what. Inside that baby, super is the new normal. You'll be stronger, tougher, resistant to rads, and... Get the suit. You can rip the minigun right off the vertibird. Do that, and those raiders get an express ticket to hell. You dig? Minigun. Now we're talking. I know, right? Only there's one hitch. The suit's out of juice. Probably been dry for a hundred years. It can be powered up again. But we're a bit stuck. I'll help if I can. What you'll need is an old pre-war FC. A standardized fusion core. Your high-grade, long-term nuclear battery used by the military and some companies way back when. And we know right where to find one. But we can't get to the damn thing. It's down in the basement. Locked behind a security gate. Look, I fix stuff. I tinker. Bypassing security ain't exactly my forte. You could give it a shot. Can't be too hard. I'll see what I can do. Well, all right. Maybe our luck's finally turning around. Once you jack the core into the power armor and grab that minigun, those raiders will know they picked the wrong fight. Good luck. <clears throat> okay, now basically, that's complete. Bingo. Here's another collectible. Then again, you can uh, you can sell the stuff that you receive or get, but it's cool at the moment for a collection. But hopefully, I can find me some like health packs, cause fuck a gun. I do. I need some aid, bro. <laughs> I ain't no, I'm gonna have to delete the save because I'm just gonna keep on dying. And here's a bobblehead. The first bobblehead, well, in the story wise, I mean, you can look around, find something, but here's the first one. There we go. Really cool. Only through observation will you perceive weakness. Your perception has been permanently increased by one. And we get very nice, very it? nice. What and you, you can also sell those if, if none of you knew. And so far. There's nothing here for me co to consume, so I'm out of stuck. Well, guys, it's getting close to the end of the video, yeah. etc. Hey, I promise. like it or not, we're all counting on you. I can't buy anything and I can't heal myself. What do you expect me to do, boy? I have 36 caps, I have a lot of weapons. She seems cold, and I'm pretty sure the radiation from outside is real warm, so. I don't want to jump down there because then I'll have to make my way all the way around, and that's just a man's work. But once I get downstairs, guys, I kind of forgot the code. I mean, 
I knew how to do it in the beginning. I was just messing around with each different code, so I figured it out, but I kind of forgot what the code was. So I'm probably going to go on YouTube for this just to um, make sure that I got it. I mean, I can lockpick this, but... Oh, first try. Nice. Nice. Wow. <laughs> I didn't even have to use the terminal. That's wonderful. No cut here, guys. It's lit. You don't need to use the terminal if you know how to lockpick. I think it was easy, honestly, because I did that first try. But lockpicking is just like in Dying a Light, except it's harder in this game, and your lockpicks can break very, very easy. So, take note of that, guys. But let's get the fusion core. That looked really cool, by the way. <clears throat> let's close this door. That's nice that you can lockpick it. This is super cool. But we take it up here, and I think he gives us a med pack, hopefully. But if he doesn't, then that's fine. I'll just eventually die. But the reason I kept dying and having to restart from, like, last checkpoint, like the beginning where I was on the platform to Vault 111, uh, I didn't save my game. And just like in uh, Dark Souls, saving your game is crucial. <laughs> just saying, save your game or you'll restart from the last checkpoint you were on. And nobody wants to do that. I sure as hell wouldn't, and I doubt any of you guys would want to do the same. So, look at these naked bodies. Amy Gans. I, I would recommend saving. Saving, saving, saving. Look at my puppy. Oh, there they are. This is. Wait, where do I need to go? Let's check the map. <coughs> Actually, the data. Freedom, put the fusion core in the power armor. I'm guessing the power armor is through here. Hey. Like it or not, we're all counting on you. Oh, that's nice. How wonderful. Wow. We go through here. Etc. I'm just gonna... Okay, here we go, here we go. I'm glad that it's pointing it. Okay, guys, we are in the commonwealth now. It's lit. But, uh... I could take it and I can play it whenever I want. Uh, dog meat found something. That's his name. I don't know why. What'd you find? Hey. Hey. Ah, uh, okay. What'd you find, brother? Okay, that's the Museum of Freedom. And when we get outside, it is a dog. This is the Commonwealth. And here's some caps. Got 17. So in total, I have. Uh, let's see. I have 53. It's crazy guys I could take I could transfer anything I want in here basically I could use a minigun etc well I saw something oh nope nope <laughs> let's get in this bitch <laughs> let's go terminate on them off as you got that let's enter it and by the way, you do have, like, after the suit, you do have to, like, find fusion cores and whatnot. And, uh, it looks super cool. It's damaged. You know how it is. And you can, you can use the minigun. Okay, best bet. Gas canister, nice. I saw something. Gas canister, oil. Please, oh my gosh. What I need the most Get is away, not asshole. there. So I guess we're gonna jump down. Hopefully it don't kill me. But if it does, then fuck it. It like drills them. It just, just wait.
I'm gonna save it right here, guys. Wait. After I. Okay, guys, I'm gonna save it right here. You saw what popped out. Just in case if I die, so I don't have to restart this, I'm gonna save it. I got it. Stay your distance. Is this infinite ammo? Oh my gosh. Ah. Ah. No words, guys. Just no words. I absolutely suck at this game. Just no words. I'm going to do cram. I'm going to do cram again. Uh... Uh, jet's good for slowing down time. Hey, get him. Good Lord. I don't have any aid for real, for real. Oh, God. <laughs> Okay, I'm, I'm good now. I, I played it smart. Now I'm just gonna heal up again. I got a bunch of red. Playing this like Call of Duty and whatnot. You know what? I'm just gonna camp in here. This is the best method because this motherfucker is strong. Don't talk crap. I have no idea where this thing is at. Where is this thing at? I dropped his health really far. There he is. Shot, bitch. Ah, that's what you get. Ah.
please. Oh, uh, death call hand. That's a weapon you can use. But finally, guys, I did it. <laughs> hey, head over there. I did it, guys. I died a bunch by this dude. Oh my gosh. My armor core fusion is low, so I can't function that well with it, but I did, guys. Holy shit, dudes. Wow. That was a pretty amazing display. I'm just glad you were on our side. I'm gonna end I'm gonna end it here guys. Uh we're gonna go after I talk to this dude, we're gonna go to our next area on our journey. So I'm gonna end it here guys. I hope all of you enjoyed. I hope some of you found it funny. The dog's rolling over. <laughs> he already likes them. That's a good sign. But I hope you like the video, guys. Subscribe for more. Comment if you like this. Comment if you want to see more walkthroughs. This is part two, by the way. I love you guys. See you in the next one.